بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين اللهم انفعني بما علمتني وعلمني بما ينفعني وزدني علما النقى العليم الحكيم اللهم اخرجنا من ظلمات الوهم واكرمنا بنور الفهم وافتح علينا بمعرفة العلم وسهل أخلاقنا بالحلم اللهم ارزقني نعمة الإخلاص لوجهك الكريم بكل ما أقول وبكل ما أفعل آمين يا رب العالمين My topic today is about short talk about ultrasound hepatic vessels or vasculature As we see here in this diagram we have the portal vein and the portal vein it is divided to the left and the right portal vein and we have the hepatic veins and the hepatic veins we have three hepatic veins the right one and the middle one and the left one and they are going to the IVC here we have the main portal vein and the main portal vein it is formed by the splenic vein and the superior mesenteric vein and the main portal vein it is divided to the left portal vein and the right portal vein and the right portal vein is divided to the anterior branch and the posterior branch as we see here, we have three hepatic veins, the right hepatic vein and the middle hepatic vein and the left hepatic vein. The water vein, the main branch, as we see here, as we see here and there, can seen clearly in the hepatic hilum and the portal vein is identified by its echogenic fibrous uh, wall and has the left and the right branch and the right branch is divided into anterior and posterior branch and the direction of the flow in the portal vein it is hepato hepatobetal means to the towards the heart and 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 it is monophasic doubler signal here this is the the flow to the Portal vein is toward the heart, hepatobetal, and it is the monophasic Doppler spectral and wave of the portal vein. And the velocity between the up to 20 centimeter per second. The hepatic artery, it is carries the oxygen-rich blood to the liver, and the main arterial branch is also located in the hepatic hilum, and it is passes between the anterior portal vein anterior between the border vein anteriorly and collidocal duct posteriorly as we see here the main border vein here and this is the duct collidoct collidocal duct and the hepatic artery as we see here it is in between between them
also as we see here this is the cordial duct both the vein and the hepatic artery in between and the direction of the flow of the in the of the hepatic artery is hepatobetal and uh, this is the normal spectral analysis of the hepatic artery as we see here and it is low resistance flow the water vein the sorry the hepatic veins originate in the inferior vena cava and normally have three main branches we have the right and the middle and the left one. The hepatic veins have hypoechoic walls, and not, not like the bottom vein would have fibrous wall, echogenic wall, making them easily distinguishable from the portal system, portal vessels. The direction of the flow of is out of the liver and it is called hepatofusal as we see here this is the one of the hepatic veins and this is the border vein the direction of the flow in the hepatic in the hepatic vein is hepatofusal away from the liver and it is in the border vein it is hepatopetal And the double signal of the hepatic vein is triphasic. Here we see the left, middle, and right hepatic vein. And these hepatic veins the, have the rapid air configuration in a transverse action as we see here in the transverse at the level of the bases and it is called bunny sign or Ibley bunny sign. It is looks like the rabbit ear. Here we have the hepatic vein spectral double signal as we see here it is a triphasic flow and this is normal here this is the hepatic vein and we see it is the direction of the blood uh, it is out of the liver and it is hepatofusal Thank you very much for listening and hoping to see you soon in another talk. Subhanakallahumma wa bihamdika ashadu an la ilaha illa ant astaghfirka wa atubu